Hi traders, S&P 500 finished the week up by 1.4% and reaching a new all-time high record. The peak of the quarterly earning report is coming this week with 65 S&P 500 companies reporting. The market is at the highs, the earning expectations are good, there are no important financial macro announcements this week that could drive the market down, therefore we expect another green week. On the downside, we have seen some major banks beating the estimates last week, however, they came down as investors were having a classic sales and use scenario. We will also see some important retail numbers coming out on Monday morning that could influence Monday morning's trading. There's some also Chinese number coming out on Monday morning, growth numbers could also influence the market and of course Trump's incident with the Russians that could again influence the market this week. However, Good earning reports or bad earning reports are a good reason for a lot of gaps. So I expect a lot of gaps this week. This should be very interesting for day trading. Swing trading also, market continues to move higher. So we expect great swing trades too. Let's have a technical view of the market. As we take a look at the S&P 500, we can see the S&P reaching new highs. And again, if you look back, you can see how it was supported. The 2400 area touched it, found the support, which was expected to be found there. We discussed it plenty of weeks and now continues higher. So again, we have an unbeatable uptrend. The trend is our best friend. Therefore, we expect the market to continue higher this week too. Let's have a look at last week's picks. We had DHI moving to a new high, reaching a profit of 7%, almost 7%. I do sell three quarters, take a partial of three quarters at a profit of 3%, therefore only quarter size left with DHI and I hope it's going to continue higher. My second pick was MGA long. MGA did great too, reaching almost 4%. And again, I take a partial at three quarters of three quarters at 3% just holding quarter size in MGA right now, hoping it's going to continue higher. Let's take a look at uh, this week's picks. My first pick for the week is W day long over 104.80, a very nice uptrend, very nice breakout formation, a company that provides cloud-based financial services in the United States. My second pick for the week is Senex Long over 1728, an aluminum company from the States. Again, very nice technical formation and I hope it's going to reach new highs once it breaks out of this consolidation area. I wish you a great trading week and see you next week. Traders, if you like to learn trading, trade live with me and get a funded account without risking your money, click in this corner in order to learn more about my funded accounts program. And if you're not subscribed to this channel, just go ahead and click subscribe. Over here, you can find some of my best live trading videos. And please, if you have any questions, let's have a discussion in the comments below.